The shark is in the water. He has closed the gap on Marvin Muskan. Go back. Blast past him around the outside. What is going on? I mean, this guy is just incredible. Get it done. So Barsha holds on to the spot. Yeah, Bosch is so good about that. Tomek Watch leaping down to the inside. Power move. To the inside of his corner. He did. But it's Tomek's good. relentless around the outside. Look at his power. He's got oh. it. Huge leap. Oh. Muskan grabs a handful of throttle again. Oh, his forward momentum. Now he tries what again. A corner from Tomek. Muskan is going to take him high. Once again, hold the spot. On the ground, you're driving forward, not in the air. Now oh. Muskan outside and trying to get Lapis out of the way. Let them sell it. Big jump down the hill. Tomek's got a line to the inside from Muskan. Big charge to the whip three line. He's on the inside. What a launch. He's got the lead. If they've got it or not, but he did. Oh, look what? at that. That was Lit good. that corner up. Yeah, there he is behind Tomac. Oh, Tomac yeah, giving it his all. Really he cool. almost did what Savacci yeah. did in the first moto. There's just nothing to grab traction with it, on the inside, but around the inside work anyway. Wow, dude, Eli's feet was off the peg. I believe he might have made the move on Savacci. We go back to Tomac. Eli seems pretty quick. Yes. Oh, oh, big move the around the outside, wheeling wow. on the downside. We're on him. Wow. Here we go. We're shaping up to have a good battle. The gap is almost gone. He's right there on the 23. Wow. He's got a wheel on the inside. He's trying to set up. Whoa! Oh. He's able to do. Do you see how he's able to go three in? And oh! He cut down and turned off nothing. Oh, wow. <laughs> too solid, too consistent. Eli Tomac goes 1-1. One, one. Leads the brakes. Wow. Good job. And look at this. Tomac comes right back. What a charge. Now Tomac's going to square it. Oh. All over the contact. A little aggressive there. Now he oh. tries it again. He brought him all out the wall. Muskan comes back. Tomac from using it. Oh, they're laying it over deep into these corners. Run it. Muskan's got a greasy inside. Oh. Yes, Tomac did it. Over it behind him. Because you can hear Adi Perico back to the outside. Oh, and he not going to make that line work. Right right. Absolutely. Tomac's going to try it again. Nowhere to go on that one sideboard. Oh, Whoa, Tomac, what a move! From the outside to the inside, and he takes over the lead. Maybe he had a chance to see what Tomac was doing, but you got to follow what to uh, Tomac And he's got Tomac right with him. Tomac has gotten Davalos also, and he gets Anderson. And it really hurts your lap time. Tomac going after Martin and gets him for third. This is a really good line around the outside. Oh, you well. have to keep charging. You have to ride smart. You have to force uh, uh, Tomac using a lot of momentum. Remember that outside line is on the wall. This could be the key spot for the pass. Here it is. He doesn't have to. Uh, to go for the first opening. So Roxon, oh, he got an opening. on the rear wheel. See if this is going to work. Roxon's momentum around the outside. Uh, Tomac's been taking the inside in this line. It's a long, sweeping left hand. That's what's important for now. Eli Tomac wins. He used every ounce of energy he had in that first moto. This is really going to be it. Motocross so demanding at this sand track. Maybe Tomac still using the outsides. There's that big jump the crowd likes. He's going to try to rail around the outside. Him. He's very cool, calm, and collected. But Tomac just looks like a rubber band. Real. And he's got the inside. He throws it sideways on the jump. No, he lands too rough in the soil. Muscat still got the inside. Oh. Tomac just greased the outside of that corner to take it away. Battling with Chase Sexton right now. These are two of the best oh, in the game. And they're going for it off. Tomax got a good drive up the inside. Is he going to Sexton wide? Oh, no room. They almost come together. And somehow Tomax. Jason Anderson got by Tony Caroli. Oh, Tomax going for two here, Ricky. Oh, Corner. Tomax a good drive. He's got two passes in three turns. Oh, Tomax oh, trying to work up that inside. He might have him here, but Barsha will fight you with everything he has. Sexton just. Oh, he's almost there. This is a move that Anderson had pulled earlier at Tomac at the number three. The Monster Energy Yamaha Star Racing Machine is in second. Roxon looks to be laboring a little bit, and Tomac is right there, showing him a wheel and makes short work. Right. Oh, wait a minute. Roxon's not impressed with that story. Now, ratcheting back up the speed of a... Just on one of those rides that I just... He is unbeatable. This guy is going for it. Colorado headed to the Lucas Oil finish line, and he wins his home race. Tightening up from the back oh. of the group. Look at Eli Tomac. What a drive out of that corner. Battling Plessinger. And Tomac. So we wanted to see what Tomac can do with a good start. It's pretty good right now. That battle yeah. hold each other a little bit. Look at Eli over the top. And, and flying foul. into that corner. This is the Eli Tomac that we expect to see with his teammate, Adam Cienzarulo, for the lead here at High Point. 
and Tomac has the number one on the outside, and he does. They almost come together. There was contact there. Their lines came together. Cincerello. He right now. Look at this. He is flying. That's the Eli Tomac that you expect to see. There it is, Eli Tomac. The shark is in the water. Eli Tomac in the second half of the final race of the day. Marvin Muskan. He was five seconds faster than Muskan the last time around. Fight between the two title contenders for second, and Tomac blasts past him around the outside. A few laps ago, when he just had this look, the way he was riding, Tomac just looks like oh, he's on another is. level, and he does. Seals he it off. Mess. Oh, look at that. He's done it again to win here at Bucks Creek. It's now number 17 here, Geico Honda rider Eli Tomac. Last time around, all three riders into 158 lap time rate. Tomac going to try it on the inside of Muscat. Wow! It's like it's just the track to rules and rules. 30 minutes and two laps, and Eli Tomac is all over him now. Martin just ripped three of them in one straightaway alone, and he's leading. Oh, Tomac over. More tear-offs being ripped by Martin. Tomac around the outside. This could be the move. Wow. Martin's have been better. He's had to ride through the pack uh, in this moto. But for the most part, he's and that's a pretty smart move because he's one heck of a rider. Tomac switches back to the left. He goes to the inside. Is he going to get the drive? Roxon knows he's yeah. riding from Ken Roxon on the 94. Tomac Ooh. goes to the inside. The crowd on their feet going crazy. They want the... Watch this. Oh, big run around the outside. Whoa. Long way around for Tomac. He's, he's got the drive, and he's going to be on the inside of the next corner. Whatever changes they made, he is feeling preppy, because look at this. He's got to go to the inside. Woo! This is a unique part of Southwick. We actually have a... Whoa, Tomac has gone down just like that, and Ken Roxon has taken the lead. Tomac's trying to come right back on him. Same spot as he did it earlier. He's got the inside lap. Tomac to the inside, takes Whoa. the lead. Roxon squares it up. Roxon's going to try to beat him oh. to the exit. No. Now Tomac's got a few more lap riders to get through. He does it. Eli Tomac wins. Tomac Eli looks, is right there. And he looks comfortable doing it. It's Hill. Here we go. The fans coming to life. Tomac to the inside. Side by side. Of the six minutes plus two laps, and the way Eli looks, he laid the race. Look at this. He's to the inside. Now. Side by side. These are the sad whoops we talk about every year at Millville. Swark, in fact, he had lost ground of the whoops. He comes right back. Outside line. Side by side. They're going to scrub together. Roxon scrubs it hard, and he gets to the ground at the top. Let's see if he can get there. Look at him scrubbing he everything. Himself up. Here we go. He's got it. He's going to try to outbreak him downhill. Look he at this. Really into the bumps. Roxon scrubs it. It's exactly the right words. He will himself, just like Tomac. It's chicane, left and right. Who's going to come out better? Oh, oh. Lap is getting not in the stake. Yep. But look at this. Back Tomac, to the, back inside. To the inside. Outside line going to work better for Roxon here. As is the mechanic, Ken Roxon. Serious oh. business here. Nice line to the outside for Tomac. Eli Ooh. Tomac, just relentless. As you would very much expect, just like he did. And the fans are getting loud, urging him forward. He takes a nice tight inside line, scrubs his way neatly over the two jumps side by side as they hit the waves. Kai Rowling will not be leading by the time they get to the start straight. Hit Rowling, and he'll use it to good effect. Triple, triple, double. He just needed to get close enough. He was close that time, and Tomac flies past Kai Rowling. Looking for running room on Ferrandis. Tomac around the outside again. Bowler to carry the momentum, but... Woo, Tomac, a big over jump. Just sending it straight away on Ferrandis. Let's see if he can make the pass. He's finally got it. Got the job done, and you know what he wants now. The lead from Webb. Look at the dirt flying off. The riders are going all the way outside, finding the smooth line, and, and it's working for him. Oh, and, that's oh. a lap. Look, he's been trying this outside right here. Oh. Exchange. Tomac comes in hot around the outside to set up for the inside here. Can he complete the pass? He's got it. He wins the overall here at Ironman Raceway. I want to see what's happening or what's coming oh, because you can it's tell serious. Muscat's frustrated. He's trying oh, to... Oh, Tomac barrels to the outside. Oh, Lapras having a look. Side. There's not going to be much room. Oh, Tomac almost had it. Yeah, Tomac squares to the inside. He's going to do ace. Tomac digging deep. Shit. Down the inside. Tomac's got a wheel on him. Almost pushes his teammate off the track. Cincerello's got to stay low and get the power to the ground because watch Eli. He's going to try and make it happen. Oh, it's track. Tomac going to go the long way around here. Uh -oh. These lines converge, and Tomac finally has the bleed. The season has gone on. What team tactics? Eli Tomac wins. There is Tomac. Not quite close enough to see. Unbelievable.
Welcome back. Eli Tomac has struck. He has not only caught this bat, 159 range. Now look at these lines. He's pressuring Durham. Durham looks over. I'm sure he expected a challenge from Baggett, but Tomac was in 13th earlier in this race. Baggett's just going to stay right there, maybe make the move. Doesn't happen. Nope. Out of nowhere, Eli Tomac. Tomac. He's going to want to do the same thing. Get around Bosch quick. He's got the inside. So two laps to go. Oh, Great spectator section there. You can almost hear them echoing through the valley. Oh, Other side line for Tomac. Big charge. Jump even had feet off the pace. Oh. Trying to get the bike back where he wanted. Big push around the outside. Bobby keeps closing the door. Oh. Oh. Who's going to get the exit of the corner? Finally, Tomac is able to execute the pass. That section is very tough. And that time it caught Marvin out. But he's got this. He does. Eli Tomac, a spectacular smoke-free patio, clean air, no problem for the 94. And this is what Tomac has to deal with, and just shoveling the roost in his face. Yeah, now look at this to the outside. Wow, look Ooh. at that speed. See if he can pick up where he left off. Can he keep Tomac? Can Tomac keep Roxon? Sometimes when Roxon's put under pressure, he's able to pick it up. But right now, trying to keep Tomac hung on the outside. No, is Ryder. Yeah, this is kind of an old-school way. Uh, and Tomac is right there, actually on the inside, looking for a pass. We talked about this last... That inside line has not worked, but Tomac is there. He might be able to get around. No. Trying to get over the wall jump. Sexton knifes over to the side to get in front of Tomac. Tomac has found something special. Where did this come from? That's incredible. I expected him honestly to drop. And the crowd, the Tomac fans, come to life. They bumped wheels. Sexton was lucky to not crash. We've yeah. seen Tomac come up short a couple times, but not this time. That is so darn hard combination. These guys. Tomac was clutch. He delivers the first moto at Ironman. Eugene funnels in the one line, but Tomac trying that outside. Look at that. Front wheel didn't touch the ground for three whoops. Downhill. Will this play a factor? Can Tomac hold the inside all the way down this thing? See what happens Ooh, uphill. He's got to run. Woo! What a drive oh. by Tomac. Oh, to the top. Shut the door. Yeah, let's see if Roxon can shut that door. And he does. The inside. Oh, he might have it. He's actually able to steal Roxon off of the corner. Kenny switches it back from right to left. One lap. But no, and he's going to do it again. Side oh, yeah. by side. Down the hill. Uh, I think maybe Tomac's got him. Oh. Laps to go. What a battle. Oh, you can tell that the breaking bat's got a killer drive. Look at this. Look at this. He's wow. got the lead already. Unbelievable. With a big 1-1 one -one at Millville. He's going to run that outside. Eli is all over this racetrack trying to get around for Anders leader. Tomac to the inside on Craig. He's got one. He's going to have a good sweeping line in this turn. And oh. Tomac right around Muskan as well. What's happening. Remember, his teammates bike just quit. Tomac around that one. Oh! And it's almost down. And Tomac... But, uh -oh. guess what? I was about to say, Eli Tomac has put in a huge charge. I didn't expect him to get there that quick. One, and just like that, what was a seven-second lead for Roxon is gone. Tomac on the move. 218, the last lap. Four seconds quicker than everyone. Oh, where? Look at what? Eli Tomac, just a quick strike outside to inside. And look he's what he's got Anderson. right here, too. Just got Anderson. What? Talking about finding a lot. Advantage. Well, they needed that break. I think Sexton was going to try to get away. The opportunity to get Sexton. Oh, no. Sexton almost threw it away. And he was able to pivot out of that rut and make a move that I... Man, where did he find that speed? Yes, in the lead. I saw him pivot out of that rut and just grab the full handful of that YZ450. Getting the momentum that comes with it. There it is, Eli Tomac. We are back, and so is Eli Tomac. And Jason Anderson knows it. With four laps to go, started putting together a furious charge. Now clearly Anderson is aware of it. Anderson is completely aware. You saw him look over the shoulder. He knows the flags. He has a look over. Tomac is right there. They're being treated to a great one down the stretch. I did not think Tomac had a shot at it. Wow. A mistake. Is that oh, a big Tomac's mistake? right there. This is going to be a pass for the lead out of nowhere. He was able to use the outside line to get around. And now Tomac as well. So hard all moto long. And, and never seems Whoa. to back off it. Came all the way to the number one spot. He could be a factor here. And watch at the top, he's gone through there with a lot of momentum, and Tomac definitely on the gas. They're side by side. And Tomac able to end the speed. Now Tomac's on the outside for this right-hander. Oh, Borsha running it in on his teammate. Wow, unbelievable Woo! challenge here. Tomac is set back. He got Bogle back there challenging a nice line by Tomac to make the pass. I don't know if he's going to. Let's see what happens in this left-hander. He's leaving the brakes late. 
makes uh, Craig go to the for his you know championship points battle. And you got to imagine. Tomac trying to figure out a way around Muscan. Outside to inside here. Roger, can you add on that? Well, we were talking about the track conditions, and there's a lot more sand within the dirt than normal. Oh, here sorry, back out front. Marvin tries to get it back. Crowd goes nuts. What did he do? Together. He, he put his hand down like Tomac. He wants this. Whoa, Tomac. Track. Baggett's trying everything. But Tomac weathering the storm. You got it. He's going to come out on top at Redbud. Firing into this pit and back out. No, wait, Tomac nowhere makes the move on Plessinger. And now he's got Canning under his sights and he makes the move. And in the second there, they ended up going back to where they were bike-wise in the first. So the country very, very rough through here. Can he handle that rough terrain and make the pass? I believe he on the inside. This different line might work to his advantage. Here it is. He'll over jump this, get the power to the... For Chase Sexton have any hope of catching at least Eli. And Craig sets himself up. He's going to have the inside at the end of the straightaway. He doesn't even need to get there. Christian Craig. And this is part of the legend of Eli Tomac. The Soil Pro Motocross. Eighth to first. Eli Tomac. There he is to the inside. Oh, Tomac, big power move from the outside to the inside wow. and wheelies by. Volume of times that we have seen Tomac at Rocks in battle. Tomac going to get the better of it this time. 20 minutes left. It's hot, yes, but he definitely has a great flow. How hard will Ferrandez fight with the title in balance? And Ferrandez looks over and Tomac takes the lead. 38 seconds. That's old school Tomac level gap. Racers on a hot, brutal, tough day. Eli Tomac is the winner. One uh, that the lead group had. Oh, there goes Tomac to the inside. Busque are going to make it any easier. Because they're not making they're... it easy on each other. Look at this. Well, and there's Roxon right there. What? So the lead was nine. Still closing on the leader. The two lap board this time around. The fitness and determination. Here it is. The white flag is coming out. Roxon trying to win his first moto of his career. To hold the low line. Oh. Remember, the next left hander is where Tomac passed Marsha. Not including that one. There's the same spot. You called it. He went after Marsha there and he goes after the lead. Are Eli you Tomac. kidding me? Eli Tomac. What is this? This is way back outside top 10, maybe 15, 20. We couldn't even find him. I was seeing right here. Yeah, you don't mean one of the best rides you've ever seen from Tomac. No. One of the best rides you've ever seen Never. from any boat motos was unbelievable. This is a totally different level. Eli Tomac wins high. as a talent he said in the 250 class he didn't win that thing by luck he just basically he is leading this race by one minute yeah. and seven seconds expected to dominate so after the top 10 of moto one he dominates moto two eli tomac leaving no doubt who the man is eli tomac has already had a chance to get cleaned up
smile for the camera, but there is simply no stopping Tomac, who had went by one minute and 31 seconds. That's one of the biggest victories, uh, margins of victory I've ever seen.